Hi everyone, here at Team O'Neill Rally School and I want to talk to you a little bit about some safe winter driving. One of the first things about winter driving is realize you can go way faster than you can stop. ABS brakes work really well to keep your wheels from locking and keep control. Uh, there have some limitations so we're going to do a little test here to see how quickly we can stop pushing as hard as we can on the brake in a panic and then also the next run will be as brake as carefully as we can without having the ABS engagement. So this is like medium speed brake really hard pushing as hard as I can and then clutching and stop. Okay, we're going to put a cone here and see if I can stop shorter than that. Same speed. This time we're going to try braking very carefully. Now, so that looks like over a car length, probably almost two car lengths shorter by braking very carefully. So we've discovered that ABS does not work as well on loose surfaces when it's slippery. So why do we have ABS brakes? Well, we found that with ABS, it allows you to brake and steer. So we're gonna try 40 miles an hour into a 90 degree turn on snow and ice. ABS, check. 40 miles an hour, check. Brake hard, oh, brake hard, turn the motor. Okay, so after I braked really hard, I knew I could not stop. So this time I'm gonna try to brake a little softer and see if I can slow down any better and just to make sure that I'm uh, thinking right here so brake gently turn gently it seemed like I can slow down and turn in much better if I'm more gentle on the brakes what we're trying to do is to get people to go away from their natural instincts is when you really want to stop you're really scared you really push hard sometimes that's not always the best Remember, the looser, the softer the surface, the softer you brake. Pavement you brake hard, snow you brake gently. Even though modern cars are safer and they have better systems, you still need to be a good driver and the good driver has good judgment. There's a lot of people out there that need to be able to go out in their first snow, they find a parking lot, find a safe area and just get used to your vehicle with your tires and your ABS braking and that temperature of the snow of that day and the grip is constantly changing in the winter so watching the temperature and getting a sense for those warmer days when there's snow it's going to be more slippery than the colder days so once again everybody need to be safe and practice how you brake and where you look and that will help you the most of any winter driving skills that you'll ever practice thank you Oh, <laughs>